Hello and welcome back to Gillette Snooker Saturday, bringing you all the shots, pots and kicks from all of today's big games. Yeah, what a chance. Well, Willie Thorne with oohs and ahs. Willie, what's going on? Well, in fairness, Jeff, I mean, what a great chance it was for Barry Pinches. I mean, he's just potted an unbelievable red. It's been absolutely inch perfect on the black, misses the unmissable black, and now it's tight on the cushion. And now it's a great chance for what harder. Back to you, Jeff. Thanks very much, Willie. Now, last we heard, Mark Selby was all over Dominic Dale. Is that still the case, John Virgo? Yeah, well, uh, not much has changed here at the moment, Jeff. Uh, and the reason I say that is, um, Selby has only got this black here to take the second frame, if you bear with me, Jeff. Yeah, so it looks like uh, he's gone on. Where's the cue ball going? Where's the cue ball going? It's in! It looked like it was 2-0. It's not. It was one apiece. Jaws rattled on table 10. Steve Davis. Yes, um, marvellous shot from Barry Hawkins. Um, just caught the near jaw. Um, tough for him to get back into the frame. Has the wheel started to fall off the car? Free ball, given away in a very dangerous position on table nine, JP. It was actually John Higgins, Jeff. He's actually tried to run up behind the yellow, believe it or not, and he's missed it by the proverbial mile. He likes to play that one again, that's for sure. Now, last time we heard it was a very cagey affair between Dot and Ebden. Is that still the case, Phil Yates? Well, to be honest, look, really, Jeff, we just had to endure a 26 minute tactical battle with no ball potted whatsoever. In fact, Simon Dane was the play that one of the gentlemen in the crowd went out saying he was about to watch it on CFAX. Now, let's see how Rory McLeod is getting on against the 2005 world champion, Sean Murphy. Adam McManus. Yeah, it's quite an even game here at the moment, Jeff. Rory's just made a nice break of 45. But Sean now is out amongst them with a chance to clear up. As ever, top punditry there from Alan McManus. Oh, it is finished betwixt us. Well, what's going on, Willie Thorne? Dear, oh dear, oh dear, Jeff. I mean, it's getting worse here. I mean, what a great chance for Watada. I mean, he's played a great run. Now he's then got to bring the pig into play. So he has to catch it off ball. Instead, he catches it quarter ball, and in doing so, finds himself tied on the cushion. So he's now betwixt the between with a very smelly shot against the cushion. Poor shot. Now, how's Mark Allen getting on against the rocket? Ken Doherty. Yeah, not too bad, Jeff, you know. I mean, it's just made a break a turdy try. You know, and there are still trials by try fines to one. Dominic Dale making a real fight of it on table three. JB! Yeah, well, uh, he certainly is, Jeff. He's uh, just played a shot all around the table, and he's finished absolutely inch perfect on the black. He was but a piece. It's now two frames to one. Dominic Dale! Thanks very much, JB. Jeff. Steve Davis, I hear in the background. What's going on, Steve? Yes, lots of um, tip tapping in the pack. Um, Michaela Tab, no option but to call a re rack. Interesting. It's about it, really, Jeff. Now, last time we heard Ebden Dot was getting a little bit bogged down. How's it going, Phil Yates? Well, in a few words, Jeff, it's not. Actually, the most interesting part of this funny is when that same gentleman returned to the arena shouting at Ebden and Dot, Look like a tortoise, you both look like a tortoise. Look like a tortoise, you both look like a tortoise. Back to you, Jeff. Thanks very much there, Phil. Dear, 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 why have you stunned it? A stunned Willie Thorne, Willie! Well, I don't believe it's Jeff again, it's Botana. I mean, what a great chance this was. He's finished absolutely perfect on the black, couldn't pick the white up and place it better by hand. And now all he's got to do is roll it along the cushion to give the pocket every chance. But in fairness, what he's done, he's stood it, and now he's jawed it. So, frame ball missed. Bad shot. Join us after the break for much more Gillette Snooker Saturday. <laughs>